hey guys welcome back to another video in this video i will be showing you guys how i got this flawless glam birthday look it lasted me literally all day if you're interested in trying out this makeup look make sure you give this video a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the channel let's get right into it again my skin has already been prepped i put on my moisturizer and all that i've cleansed my face but i'm also gonna go in with this um yummy skin glow serum by vanessa myricks um it's like this serum based primer that has some th these gold flakes in it so it sparkles and it shines a little bit so you have like that natural illuminated look when you put your makeup on top since it's my birthday i'm trying to go out with a bang i want a full beat full blown like i'm going to give the girls glam period period this is the silk priming serum by gucci so i'm going to start with concealing under my eyebrows and i'm going to use the gucci concealer uh, the multi-use longwear concealer in the color 32w So now I'm gonna go in with my Gwen Stefani Ultra Fine Brow Pencil in the color five. And I'm just gonna fill in just a little bit. I'm gonna go in with the Sephora Collection Concealer in the color Toffee, and I'm just gonna put this on the top of my brow. This concealer is more so similar to my skin color, and this is so we can prevent that halo look. Okay, so I'm gonna go in with the Gucci Concealer in the color 42W, and I'm just gonna go ahead and conceal in my highlight areas. Now I'm going to go in with my Fenty Matchstick in the color Espresso for the contour. And blend my concealer. And now I'm going to go in with Makeup by Mario Concealer, color 420. I'm gonna go in with a little bit of the Gucci Concealer in the color 32W. So now I'm going to finish my contour um, and I'm going to go ahead on the top of the forehead, the bridge of the nose, and then the bottom of the chin. My setting powder by Laura Mercier in the color Translucent. I actually mixed it with a little bit of my banana powder by Revolution. So it's gonna come out a little bit more on the honey looking side, but yeah. All right, so now we're gonna go ahead and blend out the 
concealer again with a wet, damp beauty blender. Okay, so we are as blended as we could be. And now I'm going to go in with my foundation. Child, it then came off the bottle. MFFC in the color Warm Cognac. I don't know what to tell you. is blended in I'm gonna go ahead and set the under eyes with that same setting powder that mid I'm gonna go in with the hourglass translucent powder forehead the bridge of my nose and the top of my lip with that one I'm gonna go in with the makeup by Mario concealer in the color 420 and I'm just gonna put it on my lid In this LA Girl nude tablet, very simple. I got this from I think Family Dollar. Mix like this red brown and this like brown tan together. Crease. I'm going to use the Nubian by Huvia's Blues Highlighter in the color Nefertiti. I'm just gonna put that on the lid. Ilia um, liquid powder chromatic eye tint in the color mythic and I'm gonna just put that on the top of the lid it's dark dark it's like it's not black it's more like brown but it's very dark and I'm gonna just go ahead and what they call it That was too much. And just a little bit with my concealer brush. With the Ilia, this is a light light bronzing powder in the color novelty and I'm just gonna kind of go over the highlighted areas to soften them up a little bit I know y'all can't really see how it's looking based off of the way the camera is but just know I'm gonna show y'all at the end it's looking good I'm going to be using the Kat Von D. It's the long wear tattoo pencil liner and it's just in the color black. And I'm just gonna go in with my waterline. All right, y'all, so I didn't do too much with the eyeliner. I just lined underneath my eyes. I went into the corner, and then I did a very, very small cat um, eye wing because I'm gonna put lashes on, so you're not even gonna be able to see it for real. But I just did it for the illusion of, you know, the cat eyes. This is the Kat Von D Everlasting Blush in the color Poppy. This is my absolute, absolute, 
favorite, favorite, favorite blush, okay? So I like to keep my blush on my cheeks. I know the girls have been doing like the upwards thing where it goes like all the way to the side where your highlight goes, like that chiseled look. Um, it's cute on some people, but personally, I don't like it. So I keep the blush right above the cheek area, babe. Going to go ahead and put on my lashes and I'll be right back. Okay, y'all, uh, I finally got my lashes on. It literally took me forever. This far, I stopped wearing lashes because I feel like it's just so irritating to put on. I gotta clean my nose, make it just in there. And if you wear really makeup, you know that once makeup gets in your nose, you start, start having the sniffles, your nose start leaking. Then I'm just gonna go in with the Queen Stefani mascara. This is called Can't Stop Stare Mascara, only because I love the wand on this one. It helps lengthen your lashes. See that my eye was trying to water. But I told it to stop and it stopped. Now I'm just gonna go in with the Charlotte Tilbury Airbrush Flawless Finish Setting Spray. Got this brown by LA Girl. It's just the color brown, it's a lip liner. I'm just gonna brush the liner out a little bit to get rid of like the harsh line. I'm gonna do the NYX um, Soft Matte Lip Cream in the color London. Just go over that with some clear gloss from the beauty supply store. Y'all know this gloss right here. And this one is about done, baby. I'm gonna go ahead and add my highlight. And I'm using that same highlight I used on my wings, the Juvia's Place. In the color Nefertiti. In my cheeks. Add some underneath the eyebrows. And right above the lip. I am going to just add a little bit more blush because you can't go wrong with blush. Well, Morphe continuous setting this. This is pretty much the finished product, but let me go ahead, fix my hair up and stuff, and then I'll show you, you know, how I be stepping. All right, y'all, this is the final look. Face, hair. Is it giving birthday?